And with the national debt ceiling reaching capacity today, the impact of the national debt crisis, it could potentially impact you. Yeah, 13 WREX's Dylan Valencia spoke to economic professionals from our area to learn how this could affect you at home. The national debt ceiling is currently at $31.4 trillion. The debt ceiling is the maximum amount the federal government is able to borrow, with it recently reaching its maximum limit. Well, it's kind of like hitting your credit limit on your credit card, uh, that if it hits to a certain point and you try to charge, no more charging can happen. It just means some pay uh, checks that would typically come out of the U.S. Treasury would not be able to be, you know, uh, administered. Along with this financial issue affecting the U.S. on a grand scale, it also affects citizens severely right here in the state line. The U.S. Treasury will not be able to pay checks that millions of people depend on. They won't be able to pay uh, uh, Social Security pensions. They won't be able to pay government employees. They won't be able to pay the bills that the government has. Now, if the government is no longer able to borrow, the national debt would not be continued to be paid, which can also affect veteran benefits from being paid. 13 WREX received statements from multiple congressmen regarding this matter. Congressman Darren LaHood said, quote, I do not believe defaulting on our national debt is a prudent decision for our credibility or our economic and financial stability. However, we must take steps to reduce our debt and limit out-of-control spending coming from Washington. Meanwhile, Bill Foster says, quote, For too long, the debt ceiling has been weaponized during budget negotiations creating the potential for massive disruptions to America's financial system that would have drastic consequences for the worldwide economy. Along with a lasting national impact, it will have a worldwide impact as well. Because so many of the world's economies are based on trade with and, and dealing with the American government. See, a lot of foreign governments buy these bonds as investments so they know the government will pay them back. Well, now the government can't pay those bonds back. So other countries will stop investing in the United States. Well, that was Dylan Valencia reporting. The Treasury Department is authorized by Congress to take extraordinary measures to prevent the national debt from defaulting as it's never happened in our history. Yeah, and if the debt ceiling is not raised, several of these impactful issues, they could start as early as June.